Moving to other stories, the Social Economic Rights and Accountability Project, SARAP, has filed a lawsuit against President Muhammad Buhari asking the court to declare illegal and unconstitutional the plan by the administration to track, intercept and monitor WhatsApp messages, phone calls and text messages of Nigerians and other people, as it severely threatens and violates the right to the preservation of privacy. Serap Deputy Director Kalawale Luadari says it's against freedom of privacy of individuals and family rights. You know, we call it unlawful because it fails to pass the test of legality. And to put it in proper context, um, Chapter 4 of the 1999 Constitution guarantees Nigerians certain rights, principal among which, you know, based on the topic on that discussion, is a freedom to privacy and private family life, which is Section 37 of the Constitution. And Section 39 also guarantees Nigerians the freedom of expression, that is, to communicate and vote to receive information. And uh, the law recognizes that these rights, of course, they are not absolute, which is why Section 45 provides for certain instances that uh, those rights can be derogated from. And that that uh, compasses the principle that the, the, what is called a three part test of whether such actions will be that they are legal, whether they are proportional, or whether at all they can be said to be necessary. So in this instance, there is no law presently in Nigeria that allows any of the law enforcement agencies or any other agency for that matter to monitor the WhatsApp conversations of Nigerians. And it's basically just to eavesdrop on phone calls and SMSs and other things that would go on private the phones of private individuals, which is why we say it's unlawful. Okay. And if at all there was to be any law, that law still has to conform uh, to the rights granted under the Constitution. And of course, the Constitution being the supreme law of the land, if any law conflicts with the Constitution, that is what the law says. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.